Hey, what's going on, tribe? It's Red again, just hitting you guys up with another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, so, guys, I've been kind of guided to give you guys a reading um, on your feelings and your love interests. Feelings at the current moment. It's really weird. I don't know. I don't usually do this. Um, but, yeah, I've been guided to do it as well, so... Um, just have to see what comes out for you guys um, and this is a general reading um, so if it resonates it resonates um, if it doesn't resonate um, you may want to check out another reader um, and my readings are timeless so when you come across um, this reading that is for you um, I think it's a love interest or someone someone you're dealing with feelings it's either your feelings or their feelings um, yeah, I don't usually do this, but I've been guided to do it, so, which is very strange. Um, yeah, if any of you guys are interested in, um, a personal reading as well, um, I've been guided to do it for half price at the moment as well. So instead of being £40, they're £20. Um, if you guys are interested in a personal reading, um, you can send me an email or you can DM me on Instagram. Let's see what comes up for you guys. The collective feelings at the moment. And the first card you got is happy. And then the card says, I want to make you smile again. So some of you, um, the road is starting to get um, a bit lighter, is what I'm getting. Um, and what I get from this, is this um, some of you are reconnecting with someone or... Um, the person that you're you have in mind um, makes you happy and brings out um, the happiness in you, which is which is good. Um, let's see what else comes up. Um, and then your next card is distracted, and then the card says, "I can't get my mind off of you." So some of you may be. Um, Maybe, I wouldn't say obsessive, but um, over, maybe overthinking the situation. Is it going to work out? Isn't it going to work out? What are my flaws or their flaws? Or some of you are dealing with, um, yeah, some of you are just overthinking the situation. Um, just go with the flow and just be your natural self. Um, that's the best um, how to get to know someone is being who you really are. Um, and the person if the the person will either accept you for who you are or they won't um if they don't then that clearly shows they're not for you if you can't be um who you truly are around this person um then they're not for you like you've got, got to be able to be comfortable and let out your i don't know inner nerd um whatever your interest interests are whatever you're drawn to you should be able to share with this person or your person of interest um and they should show an interest in what you're um you're um interested in as well to make things work if um if it is if they're the right person for you they will show an interest and your next card is responsible and then the card says i need to start saving myself instead of everyone else yeah some of you have been put in um everyone first um, and now it's time to put yourselves first. Um, yeah, maybe you need to. Maybe you've been putting everyone else first and trying to get yourself sorted out. And maybe you've got kids and stuff. But um, it's okay to be open to love and um, new relationships. Um, that your children shouldn't be. Yes, you have to um, put your kids first, but it doesn't mean you cannot move on from the kid's father is what I'm getting. Um, so if you have a, lump, a love interest and you've still got somewhat feelings for your kid's dad, but it's, um, it's not going anywhere, it's okay to move on. Um, and put your needs first in this situation is what I'm getting. Um, some of you are definitely healer, healers and been putting everyone f first and your love life has been affected by this is what I'm getting. And your next card says foolish and then the card says I've made a fool of myself so <laughs> uh, 
Uh, what I get from that is there might have been certain situ something might something's happened um, where they might have. What I'm getting for this, this is I don't know if it resonates. It resonates. Let me know. Um, someone acts the complete opposite of. Is it just reminds me of someone like back in school days. Um, you know, like if girls had a crush on a guy, um, they would act like they hate the guy, but really they really like the guy. Um, so some of you are deep doing that. Um, so you may have a love interest and you may act like you fucking hate them or whatever, but really and truly you love them and that is what I'm getting. And obviously they're not aware of this. So they you, they, you may be being mean to them and they're thinking like they ain't even done anything, uh, but you're re you really like them and is is what I'm getting from that card. <laughs> Some of you use that bare childish in it. And um, your next card is tame. And the card says, you make me feel calm and free. So your person of interest makes you feel um, kind of centered and balances you out. I've spoke to a few people and it comes up and uh, it comes up, but um, yeah, the person of interest kind of calms you down. So if you're a bit wild or a bit out there, your love interest kind of brings you to balance and kind of centers you. Um, it doesn't have to be a love interest. Well, yeah, I would say love interest, but the person who's, who comes to mind um, brings you kind of inner peace, should I say, and um, they may be able to tame, they can kind of level you out. So if you're a bit wild or whatever, if you're an intro extrovert, they may be introverted. So when you guys get together, there'll be a balance, if that makes sense. Um, or if you're introverted, they may be extroverted and they may bring you out of your show a little bit. Um, which is cute. Which is really cute. Um, it's, yeah, it's it's about balance. Like I said, yeah, that's... Um, yeah, you do... Uh, you do what they do. They bring you a sense of peace and inner... You can be yourself around this person, is what I'm getting. Oops, God. And then your next card is seductive. And then the card says, Every night in my dreams you seduce me. <laughs> um, what I get from that, if you haven't had sex yet, um, some of you are fantasizing about that. Or if you have had sex, you um, are playing out, scenario <clears throat> playing out scenarios in your head, is what I'm getting. Um, some of some of these are very sexual in nature. Some of these are very sexual in nature, and some of these need to learn to be more open and submissive. Not like like the BDSM submissive. I mean like being open and like being more vulnerable to your man or woman. Well, it depends what sex you are. Um, and you can be a masculine with a feminine energy or you can be a feminine with a masculine masculine energy um, energy doesn't have no boundaries like that um, let's see what else comes up and then your next card is determined and then the card says I will never stop trying to do do better so some of you are going through some of you are growing in your journey some of you are growing um, no one's perfect everyone's uh, made mistakes but some of you are determined to grow and change and some of you are growing and changing is what I'm seeing uh, and you're trying to better yourselves you're realizing that your old patterns no longer serve you uh, no longer serve you and you're trying to you're evolving some of you are evolving and the next card you got is relaxed and then the card says, I find pe I found peace again. So some of you are coming more into um, balance, should I say. Um, yeah, some of you are coming more into balance. Um, and starting to kind of more disconnect with whatever situation you're in. And letting it flow and be centred. Um, letting it flow, go with the flow. Like if it comes, let it. If it goes, let it. Um... Yeah, sometimes certain situations are, are for you and some certain situations aren't for you. But um, you, you're you beginning to either taking, taking it or leaving it and not getting too worried about the outcome of a situation. You're quite centred 
and relaxed um, about how things are going. And then the next card says, illuminate. And then the card says, your light helped me. Your light helped to guide me out of my darkness. So someone is, um, someone is um, maybe you're inspiring someone. So by sharing your experience with them, um, they can get an understanding of where they're at. So if you've been, I don't know, had certain problems or certain lessons arise in your life, um, talk to talk to this person about it. Or if you're having problems, reach out um, because they, they can help you with your current situation is what I'm getting, um, feeling wise. And then the next card is um, committed. And then the card says, until death do us part isn't enough. So some of you have known each other before. Um, some of you may be on the twin flame journey or some of you, um, this is like a soul, like a soul connection from a past life. Um, and you keep kind of meeting again in different carnations and stuff. Um, someone may be getting engaged is what I'm getting as well. But um, yeah, I, I see two souls kind of coming together. Um, and a committed relationship is what I'm seeing. Very interesting. And then your next card is um, unbalanced, unstable, sorry. And then the card says, I am walking a thin line between being okay and being a complete mess. Yeah, some of you are going through tr um, some kind of transformation. Um, if you're going through like a dark night of the soul, um, they can push you to the edge and make you feel like you're going crazy and feel like you're being um you're unstable and stuff um this could be either you or your partner they may be going through um, a spiritual awakening some of you are more spiritually evolved is what i'm getting and the other person kind of not not look to you for guidance but you inspire them on their path um and the stuff that you've been through kind of they can relate to so your journeys are very similar is what i'm getting and then um your next card is working and the card says I'm just really busy working so if you haven't had contact with this person um, yeah they've been doing some soul searching they've been going within and trying to find answers um, and may, they maybe they've been working very hard as well on in the physical realm but they've been doing work internally is what I'm seeing um, Yeah, some of you are working. Some of you are on the grand internal work. Some of you guys are leveling up, is what I'm seeing. Yeah, some of you want to level up. And some of you are leveling up, is what I'm seeing. And your next card is integrity. And then the card says, I am trying to do the right thing. Yeah, see what I'm saying? Some of you are leveling up. Some of you are no longer interested in the 3D world and the 3D pleasures are no longer cutting it um so you want more fulfillment um deeper connections um or they um take it take it out it resonates as either you or them their feelings who i'm picking up um yeah someone wants more and the 3d stuff ain't gonna cut it you know like that surface level shit is not gonna cut it no more someone wants more deeper connections more of a soul connection not surface level and some people yeah someone's not some people are just in, not interested in that 3d stuff no more um and your next card is misery then the card says i am haunted by my past and my own inner darkness so it's for some of you guys some of you guys are uh, doing a bit of soul searching and scared to share your past maybe with this person or that your past is coming up to be healed and released um, and it's okay to share your past with this person and to as long as they, they can be trusted um, It's being about being vulnerable and being how being able to share your experience and they should be coming from a place of like non-judgment Because everyone's got a past and history like no one's perfect and we've we learn and grow from our experiences Some people like to stay the same and some people like to change if they like to stay the same then they're kind of maybe not on the same path as you but someone's doing some inner work right now um whether it's you or them hmm. 
and then you got passion. And then the card says, you make me feel things I can't even describe. Um, what I'm getting for that is you've in, you... They're really attracted to your mind, is what I'm getting. Like that, that, they're really. That, some of you can. Um, some of you's. Yeah, some of you are very interested with their mind, and um, more want uh, intellectual connection. You're not really. You want some of you want to be, your partner, your new partner, or love interest to be able to teach you stuff. Um, And it's, yeah, some of you, yeah, you want uh, intellectual, more intellectual relationship, someone who gets you on the same wavelength. Um, and you may already find this person, is what I'm getting. Um, I do love these cards, these cards are cool. Um, and your next card is Warmth. And the card says, I miss you and, and, your, and your warmth. Um, so yeah, maybe when you're around this person, they can be who they really are. Uh, maybe bring out their child childlike side. Maybe they can feel like they can let their boundaries down uh, with you. If they do, don't um, take advantage of this situation because um, they do feel comfortable with you. Is what I'm getting. It's really, really strange. Not strange. It's just um, what's coming up. What I'm being guided to tell you. Um, <laughs> And your next card is Innocence. And then the card says, I swear I didn't do it. <clears throat> there may be a situation where you think they've done something wrong or done something, but um, yeah, no, they've been honest. They've been honest with you. You may think they're lying about a certain situation, maybe cheating or um, seeing someone else or something, but they're being genuine is what I'm getting. And then your next, your last card is healing, <laughs> and the card says, "I know we can fix what has been broken." So some of you, um, whatever situation you're go going through right now, is healing and it's going through a transformation. Um, someone's doing a lot of internal work right now. Yeah, some of you are doing some internal work, internal work right now, and doing a lot of healing. But things are pretty balanced and things are looking really positive for this situation whatever situation you're in but um yeah if you like the video um don't forget to like share subscribe and don't be shy i see you guys watching but not liking but um i'm gonna hit you guys up real soon anyway with another reading anyway peace love and light drive